Hi everyone, this is Etta, and I was coming to you today to do a wig review on the uh, haul that I did in one of my prior videos. And today I'm going to do a review on uh, her name is Flora, and she is uh, from Silhouette, and she's in a 1B33, and she's a short curly wig, and um. I have I have wore her only once to take a picture and before it's wearing out anywhere I never never had the chance to wear her out yet. So I decided that this would be one of the first ones that I would do my review on. So I'm gonna go ahead and take out the out the pack. I got her at the time when the hair sisters was having that big sale. And I think only I paid like nine dollars and ninety nine cents for her. So I mean you couldn't go wrong with that. So she is a she is a pretty wig. I think she is. For the especially for the price. Now, this is what she looked like. She's curly, as you can see. And she's soft very soft nice curls in her nice bouncy curls now on the inside she has one comb in the front and one small comb in the back and she don't have no straps so to make her extra secure, I would put some pins in her, you know. Okay, let's try on and see what she look like. Oh, so also on this side, she has the, she's just the basic wig cap with the mono top and the tracks. So I'm getting ready to put her on. See, she's real pretty. Nice curls, soft, bouncy. And also, you can put some hair out in the front if you like, but in my opinion, necessarily, she don't need no hair out. Um, what I would do is probably like put a little baby, little of your own baby hair out with it, in which that's what I'm going to do, and I'm going to use my QP glaze to do that because that's all she needs she has a nice hairline where it don't look fake like some of them do so I'm just gonna make a little of my own baby hair hopefully you all I'm sorry for madam if I'm all out of range I'm doing this on my webcam uh, see I'm just combing some baby hair out and I use my QP glaze using that to make some baby hairs and what I'm gonna do since she don't have no straps in her I'm gonna I will pin her down because just that little tab look like she just started kind of, you know, trying to crawl up a little bit. So I would put some pins in her. I'm gonna use the large bobby pins on the side. And also I'm going to use my small bobby pins in the back. I just take it and just go down through the tracks and just pin it down. 
you know, it depends on how you want to do it. Um, Sometimes I might take the bobby pin and go up and um, take the bobby pin and take it up like this. And that also holds it in place. Now I have some of this uh, this Beverly Johnson Luster Mist Spray. You can see that. But it's, um, it's for the wet it's a wet look wig moisturizer. So I'm going to spray a little bit on there. Just a little bit. Just kind of play with her a little bit. I think she's a pretty wig. Um, just to wear, you know, you can wear out, you know. She can be worn out. She can even be worn to work. You know, she's conservative, playful with it. So, I think you could do it either way. Whichever way you prefer. I decided to try some curly wigs because I didn't have many of them in my collection, so I decided to just try something different, you know. Arizona. For some reason I'm not getting this front exactly the way I want it, but but it's it's coming out okay. And if I didn't mention, uh, again, she's in a 1B33. Okay, so what you think? This is what she looked like in the front. Side. Back. Okay, again, this is Flora uh, from the maker of Silhouette. This is what she looked like again. Got it, Hair Sisters, for $9.99. So, for that price, you can't beat it. And it's a nice looking wig. Nice for the summertime. Put your little sundress on, you know, be real cute. I think so. All right then, well, you all have a good day, and don't forget to rate and subscribe and let me know how you like it. All right, you all have a blessed day, and talk to you later. Bye-bye.